Welcome to Auntie's Creative Studio. I'm Auntie. Hang on. Okay. I, I want to echo and I know if I hear one knocking in. We, I am going to review the Fable Castell Go Fable colored pencils. I just got the 12 count. They do come in different counts. Um, I lost my list. <coughs> they came in 48, 36, and 24, and 12 count. But the good thing is, they do, you can buy them individually at Hobby Lobby Michaels. They buy $1.50, I think, for one. Cheap one in the, um, oh, Prism Con. So, take that how you want to. The uh, writing on them is, to me, is easy to read even with my 47 year old eyes. Um, I have used them, as you can tell. I've played with them for a while. They've got a 3.0 mm lead. They have break this resistant. I mean, they don't break like a lot of other pencils I have had. They are easy to sharpen, very soft, can do multi layers. They are numbered, but they don't have the color of the pencil on on the pencil. Uh, comes with a booklet and. Well, I'll be damned. <laughs> I said none of this was in English. But it is, some of it is in, in English. But a lot of it ain't. So, but it does come with the booklet with the number and the pencil, the name of the pencil. The coral, the, the top matches, pretty well matches the lid. As you can see, uh, they are made in Germany. Let me mark some of this stuff off my list so I won't repeat myself. Oh, I just had an ink pen. Yeah. Okay. You can layer with them. They are numbered. Comes with a booklet made in Germany. They are echo friendly if you. They came in a little tin. You can buy them individually. They come in. And now I I bought some other stuff from Fable Castell at the same time. I got these. And I contacted the customer service and they was not helpful at all to me. Take it. Believe it. I mean some people says they've got great customer service. Maybe it's just the one I got a hold of that didn't know what he was, they was doing. I don't know. So, that's my experience with the customer service. And today, we are going to have some, a little bit of fun. We're going to do something totally off different than normal. I'm taking one of these little small sketchbooks. And I am going to do something I normally don't do online. I am going to draw a boat. Wait, I've already screwed up. Can y'all play that one? Let's change pencils. Because I got a feeling I'm going to need the erase. Okay, what I'm going to do is put a dot here and a dot here. And then I'm going to make my well, I say I am, I may not. Well, we're gonna go down further. Okay.
and you know, I'm just kind of playing today with this just so y'all know I um, don't do anything I mean I'm not being that serious with it <coughs> Got a dog chewing on my toes. And I'm just using uh, eraser toppings with this pencil. This is um, Dale and Ronnie sketching HB pencil. Okay. All, I, uh, all I'm doing is drawing something to demonstrate the colored pencils. So, and I don't know, I've got on a boat kick lately. And I don't even like being out on the boat, so I think it's just heat. I'm just thinking water. But y'all seen how easy that was to dry. Okay, I am going in with 115, and I want to say it's called orange. Don't have my color swatch out. Dark cadmium orange, sorry. And yes, and I'm going just go in. I'm not calling the whole deal interest. And this paper, if y'all can, see, if y'all notice, it is a gray tint. And I haven't had much. I ain't done much on the gray tint. So y'all just bear with me. Now, do I like these better than I do Prism? Not really. Because they are so soft. And it takes so... I mean, they ain't vibrant like the Prism corners is to me. But they are easy to lay down. And they are real easy to sharpen. Even with a handheld. Now, I'm going back over with 121. And it is... Something Grand Grandinman Lake. Me, it's red. Y'all know how these prints are companies, paint companies, and all has these real names. And with a limited of 12, I may be just because it's so, they are limited, but I mean, I know you can, you know, use about any color to get the color you want. And as I've said, even on yesterday's videos, I like my sh my pencil sharpen to a fine, fine point. Even if I'm writing, using the pencil to write with, I want that fine. That's why I've always liked the me uh, mechanical pencils. 
like 5.0 or 3.0 I've always been that way Now I'm going in with the uh, 120, and I think it's Ultramarine Blue. Yeah. Oh, that didn't come out. I used the wrong. And I'm just going in to get in some of my donk donkons. I mean, my donks. Yeah, I would use something else. I mean, I would use, you know, a darker red normally, but I don't have one. And now I'm going back over it with the red. And it's getting really glossy on this paper. And it may just, I mean, I've never really noticed it. So it may be just this paper too. Okay, now I'm taking the white, and it's 101, and I'm telling y'all, it, it does better than I, if I, I thought it would, but it still don't do as good as the prism, I mean, it don't blend as good as the prism comes. To me, it don't. I mean, that's my opinion. I mean, before anybody gets upset with me, that's my opinion. That ain't nobody else's. It's mine. Okay. I'm going in. And this is all white. <clears throat> and this is why I've done it on the tone or gray paper, tone paper. And I'm out of the line as usual. It'll be okay. Like I said, this is just a one, two. And I'm not layering a whole lot. Okay, the seat is also white. Now you can color your bow any color you want to. You can do blue, pink, purple. You know, do it like you want. I mean, I ain't telling y'all how to do it. I mean, y'all can use any colors y'all want. Use what color pencils y'all want. This is just my review on these. Um, Go Fable, Fable Castor L, Castor. 
Okay, now I am going in with the 176, and I want to say it's a bouncy in there. Yeah. And I'm just going in, to, and I'm barely even pushing on this. I just want some dark shadows for the bottom of the seat. Now I'm going back in with the white. And like I said, I just want just a little bit of shadow. I'm going back in. With the brown. And right here at the end of this um oh I'm going and right here I'm going really darker than what I have been. Then I'm just gonna blend it out. Same thing over here. And this may not be exactly how to do this. I'm not going to sweat nothing today. It's been one of those days. You know, when you get up. Well, you, you get up early, and then you go back to bed. And when you get back up, you decide, well, it's time to show and get ready for the day. Well, you go in and get to get in the shower, and you have no water. What the heck, folks? And yes. The water bill's been paid. For anybody says anything. So, that's the day I've been having today. I am pushing pretty hard on this white to get it to come through. Okay, now, it looks like it's going to sink. So, let's add some water. Y'all want to play? Let's see. Uh, I got a few minutes. I am going back in with the ultramarine and blue. Now, I am going kind of... No. I'm going to go this way. 
Maybe I need to go this way. I don't know. But I'm just using my, I'm just going in very lightly. And we may have this boat sinking. I don't know. And I'm just going off the page. Y'all, I'm just amazed at some stuff that people write on YouTube channels. You know, this is my channel. I do what I want. I buy the stuff I use. I'm not sponsored by nobody. And if somebody sends me something, I would let y'all know. It was sent to me. But 99.9 .9 of the stuff that I review or I use on this channel, I buy with my own money. <sighs> Just saying. I'm going shopping this green 163. That emerald green. I want the water kind of greenish, bluish. That's why I'm going back in with the emerald green. Ah, oh, I'm so sick of ants. Don't forget about the uh, contest we've got going on. Uh, the details is on MeWe, and I will have a link down below for MeWe. Um, let's see. I think that's about all I've got of the announcements this week. Yeah, it is hot here. I'm just now pulling off and going to town in order to get dog toys. Now for my dog. For my son's little dog. He got a, a mutt. But he's, he, I think he was ready for one finally. We hope. Now I'm just going in with the white and kind of making highlights and kind of blending some of this in together. Mm -hmm. 
And like I said, this is not a good drawing. I mean, I kind of just do it together, so to speak. Now, right around the boat, right under it, I am going to make it a little bit darker because of the shadow. And then I'm just going to kind of let it play out. Mm -hmm. Ah, I don't know what I'm And <laughs> sign your name to it. Seven. Seven, I think. Twenty one. I hope y'all enjoyed this and I hope y'all enjoyed the review. I hope it makes I mean if you got the prison card, I would not spend the money on the Fable Fable Castells because I was I'm not impressed with it that much. That's my opinion and you know, take it or leave it. I mean I don't care how it how you do it um you can get these at walmart the 12 set at walmart and that's where i got mine they was 14 14 14 15 but less than 15 bucks so i hope y'all have a blast day and we'll catch you tomorrow and tomorrow we'll have a hopefully an oil painting at least started and if you Working oils, you know it takes forever for that stuff to dry. So we may have to do this this next painting in sessions. But we'll see what we can get done. Y'all have a blessed day. Bye.